Hi, this is Alex Mikowski again, um, coming to you live from my car. Um, so as part of being mobile, um, we're often out in the community and in, in our various um, vehicles. Um, so I wanted to go over a little bit more of what the local services are. Um, this is a very quick kind of uh, quick and dirty. Um, so please feel free to put any questions you have below in the comments. Um, I always like to emphasize the National Suicide Prevention Lifeline. Um, so they have both a phone number and a text line. So you text GOT5 to 741741. Um, and so it's great to have somebody to text with or chat with that you're never going to meet again. Um, but they can um, get you emergency help if you need it. But they can also just be a person to listen. Um, there's also mobile crisis, there's the regional open access center, um, normally there's, there's local, um, things you can do in person, so Cortland County Mental Health has a crisis, um, visit policy that you're just having a horrible day and you really need to talk to someone, um, they'll talk to you. Things right now are in pandemic mode, so things are a little different than normal, um, and uh, the Wishing Wellness Center is a program of Catholic charities that they have um, peer advocates, so people that have gone through lived experience um, and have found wellness, and now they help others. Um, uh, family counseling also has a, a strong mental health um, side. And then on the substance abuse side, um, there's uh, Beacon, uh, Syracuse Recovery Services, and Family Counseling Services. Um, so normally we have same-day, next-day access. Right now, um, sorry, seeing the inside of my car. Right now, things are a little different as everyone's trying to figure out how do we do services in a world where there's a pandemic happening. Um, trying to keep both our, our staff safe and also keep um, the client safe um, so they feel like they're, they're going to be okay. Um, so I will come back in the next video to talk about what does Cody do. Um, and then how do you take care of yourself after um, supporting someone else or going through this thing that everyone's going through about how, how do we deal with COVID. So I'll be right back. Stay tuned.